Hey, peace, peace, love and light to you all, family. Welcome to another YouTube video with me, your host, Mathix Mathlangu. Now, on today's video, I want to talk to you about something that we all deal with on a regular. Be it that you are on the spiritual journey, consciously or unconsciously, because we are all on the spiritual journey. The only difference is that some people are on the journey consciously and others are unconscious and thus then most of those who are unconscious of the journey that they are on most of those people are ignorant now before we continue don't forget to like and to subscribe to the channel so that you can get more videos in future and also press that notification button so that you can be notified every time i upload new videos so now first of all the way to deal with ignorant people the first thing to do is to accept you have to accept that there will always be ignorant people around you your friends people that you grew up with your boss at work your fellow employees your family members especially especially when you are on the spiritual journey and you are doing the work now to accept that is freedom because when you accept that there will always be spiritual people it pushes you away or rather it removes the angry factor that comes with that because ignorance can can become annoying after a certain amount of time especially when you observe people who do so much ignorant things you know when you see people do all these things unconsciously and unaware when they are so misinformed the violence the black on black violence the killings the xenophobia the crime against each other the rapings the gender-based violence the lying so all of this the governments politicians you know they are ignorant ignorant of the needs of the people so when you when you accept that when you accept that there will always be ignorant people it liberates you because number one you must understand one thing that you too once upon a time were ignorant ignorance is a vibrational state it is a state of being it is a vibration when you are ignorant you are vibrating at the lower portions of your mind you are functioning from the the lower parts of your brain remember that your brain is divided you have a mammalian brain you have a bird brain you have a reptilian brain now most people who are functioning from a point of survival and fear meaning that they do things to survive they do things out of fear so when the government comes and says do this without consciously observing and analyzing in terms of why should i do this why should i why should i take the, the certain actions they 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 are pulled or drawn in by things that happen on the surface level so when someone is ignorant they do not have that ability to go deeper and dissect issues be it personal or be things that concern all of us so the government comes says do this they do it their friends come say do this let's go here they are so hapacitous you know they they they, they, they react that's a form of ignorance the inability to step back and look at yourself and look at situations from a different perspective that is ignorance but but when you accept that it becomes a benefit because people who are ignorant provide you with the mirror they act as a reflection in order for you to see where you were and where you are now when when they were crucifying jesus on the cross whether you want to think of these things being an actual history or whether they were metaphorical and symbolic uh, or rather symbology which they were when when they were crucifying him on the cross jesus being the conscious part and and god being the higher elements or the higher brain he says that father higher consciousness he says father forgive them for they know not what they do that's how i when i look at people killing other people from certain countries seeing you know all these xenophobic acts it's it's a form of ignorance it's ignorance because they do not know when you kill someone who looks like you over material things these people don't know when people attack you because now you have a different way in which you relate to the creator it's a lack of ignorance I mean it's rather a lack of knowledge of self so when you accept 
that there will always be ignorant people. It liberates you. And another thing that, that you must understand now is that you should not judge. Do not judge because the moment you judge and say, ah, this person is like this. They don't know this. Ah, oh, they doing this. They doing this. You, you are basically also now judging yourself. Remember that I said that they act as a mirror. Your, your, your job is not to judge, but to observe the actions and then learn from that. They provide you with the school because even the most ignorant person still has divinity within them. It's just laying dormant. Each person is still a divine aspect of a universal, omnipotent, omniessence creator. Temporarily acting in that ignorant form of itself. So they, they act as a mirror in order for you to see where you were and where you are right now. So you accept, you don't judge. And number three, you don't try and teach. It says when the student is ready, the teacher will appear. You don't go to people and try to force on them information and knowledge that they are not ready for. It would be the same thing as someone who is studying the highest science or any field in university going to a child in preschool and trying to force feed that information on them. Their level of, of awareness and consciousness and, and the expansion of the mind, it is not at that level. The difference is that they say many are called, few are chosen. Not everyone is going to awaken in this lifetime. It's because some people actually have younger souls. Some people's souls are old and old in terms of incarnation and experience. So some people, you right now listening to this information on whatever day it is, you having an interest in this, it's because your soul is vibrating at the level that you are ready or you are able to receive this. It's because you have been prepared over many lifetimes. You are an elder or an initiate. You are being initiated into this level of knowing yourself in order for you not to become an adept, someone who, who, who will be mastering this certain type of knowledge. Not everybody, not everyone can vibrate to the level of this knowledge. You really have to be vibrating at a different frequency, at a different level. In order for you to be a master. Now, some people still have karmic debts to take care of. Because in past lifetimes, you might have been a killer. You might have been many things. You might have been many things that there's the certain karma and certain things that need to happen in order for you to now clear that. And for you now to be ready for new experiences. This is what is happening on the planet. So there's old souls and young souls. So when you when you come and try and force information on everybody, even your parent, you could be dealing with your father or your mother and they are older than you physically. But on a spiritual level, you could be an elder. Your soul could be older than your actual parent. You see, so it's not about trying to force information on people it's about you understanding now how you deal with ignorant people let's quickly review it you accept that there will always be ignorant people you will always be dealing with ignorant people even in the spiritual community you don't judge you don't judge and you don't try and force information on people and if you can get these three everything and everyone will be a lesson because the most ignorant person who has never heard of a chakra or a third eye or amalos who to say they don't believe those people too they are lessons earth is a school everything and anything is a school it's an opportunity for you to learn you don't just learn from people who've come to know the knowledge you learn from everyone everyone and everything has something to teach you the only difference is that now you must try and remove yourself from the the places where so-called ignorant people maybe go dwell at because th there's there's low vibrational energies there there's low vibrational energies and if you don't want to align yourself with that you don't have to you know you don't have to go to places that you don't feel energetically drawn to you see what i'm saying so that's that's how you deal with with ignorant people because you will always find them you will always find them you will always find them but be grateful be grateful and because you awaken through grace and and it's your it was your time to awaken
It was your time to come into this knowledge. So peace, love and light to you all family. I hope that you learned something in this video. And yeah, much love. Worldwide, I'm still plotting. Worldwide, I'm still scheming. Babylon, oh, you know the big love, the moon, yeah. But I still in the